just looking at this little graph here, these two graphs are the uh, graphs of the intensity of the two beams. Um, so this is beam one on this side, beam two on this side. And so earlier, I don't know, half an hour ago, we had these steps up or when they add an extra bunch to each beam. Um, so at the moment we've just started climbing again here. This is the current time. So we've got now four bunches in beam one and we have three in beam two and I'm just continually pressing this. Oh, now we have four bunches in both things. So it's just, um, just got up to the uh, exciting stage again. The, the trace there, well, you have the nice neat spike before, yeah, yeah. and then... Yeah, but just the, the score for picture from the yeah. DPK. So you see, we saw it there going on, there dropped down, and you get the, the measured current. Any moment? Huh? Any moment? Any moment? After four. Any uh. moment? <laughs> <laughs> Starting to inject in beam two. Uh -huh. Yep, beam two is up. Okay, that was fast. Oh, it's got one much in this. Fantastic. The fact that the accelerator will set the stable beam flag is really what tells us that the accelerator is ready to deliver beams for doing physics with, as opposed to just for commissioning the machine. So this is really their statement that they think they're in control of the machine and that it's safe for the detectors to be fully active and, uh, and start doing physics. The thing on November 23rd for me was uh, mostly uh, just uh, a test of the machine. Really. Um, and we were just observing, but this is the real thing. So everyone packed up and went home at the end of the day, night feeling pretty disappointed having been up for some of them 30 hours or so. Um, and then half an hour later we get this call saying, oh, we got stable beam. And so they just sort of turned it on unexpectedly. Maybe the next team had come in with fresh eyes or whatever else and solved the problem and uh, away we went. <laughs> Okay, they were solved the problem and uh, you have to come back because there is the, for the first time stable beam. So this was the first time in the history of LHC with stable beam. I switched on the innermost part that is adjusted 5 centimeters from the beam, uh, that is in the vacuum pipe. And, uh, and then uh, suddenly we got uh, kids everywhere and uh, beautiful trucks in magnetic field. It was, it was really nice. So it was